Oh, hey there. I am super excited to be sharing this information with you. I wanted to go through the process of a vehicle wrap, the actual start to finish that I was able to do for my personal business and never imagined that I would be able to do something like this in my marketing budget. However, um, dreams come true. Hi, I'm April Peck with Emerge Real Estate Excellence from the greater Columbus, Ohio area. And I wanted to share with you, just in case some of you are teetering the idea of taking your marketing to a different level. Hmm. So where do you get started? How do you get started? Why did you get started? <laughs> so for me, um, I just wanted to come up with something that was just a little bit different to set me apart from my competitors. And um, I thought that I would like to have a purpose. For this vehicle wrap, I wanted a mobile marketing billboard. And for me, um, I, I didn't want a box truck. I, I didn't want to go down the path of letting people rent my van for free if they use my business. Um, I actually thought that if I could just create a mobile office, a mobile home office, and that was um, my goal that led me to what type of vehicle to use. Um, so I decided not a box truck, um, didn't wanna just use a typical car. I wanted something that was going to give me extra space for my clients. So that way, if clients were riding with me on property showings, their kids could come, their parents could come, I could fit everybody in there, also have enough space for my real estate signs. And um, that's how I basically got started, was choosing what I was trying to do. What is the purpose of using a vehicle wrap for my marketing? And then the second thing is um, I set a budget. budget on my vehicle, added a budget, a second budget for how much I was going to spend on a wrap. And um, of course, sometimes those budget budgets change. Uh, the first couple of vehicles I went to look at, um, one of them was ticking, the engine was ticking. So we had to make a quick call to um, our mechanic. That's what I wanted to do. All right. Yeah. Thanks for the advice, man. I'll let you know before we decide. And ask if that was something normal or something that could be repaired. Um, so that budget automatically went up on the vehicle because um, I didn't want to get a vehicle that um, we were going to put all this money with the expense of the wrap. And six months later, the vehicle breaks down and we just tied all this money into a wrap on a vehicle that no longer is on the road. Um, another reason the budget went up a little bit is because I needed something reliable. So if I would be putting clients in my um, vehicle, it would need to be reliable, good tires, good engine. Um, you know, didn't want to be breaking down alongside the road with clients in my vehicle at all. So that would not be cool. I'm on my way to Obetz, Ohio to work on a new project that I'm super excited about and it's going to be involving some marketing and branding for my business. Hey, I'm here at 
mad graphics and I'm working on um, some vehicle wrap designs with the owner Seth Likens and I'm super excited to be here today this is gonna be amazing Here with Seth Likens, owner of Mad Graphics, and we're here to talk about my vehicle wrap. Yeah, if we could do the trade R after that, that last, that last R. Exciting news for branding and marketing my business. Okay, so budget number two is the actual design wrap. And um, if you take a look, you can see that I had a single image put on the hood and then also a single image coming across the, um, the windshield. I did not have the grill. I did not have the grill done. So my vehicle wrap is technically a partial wrap, which saved me probably about five to $600 by not having the grill done and also by not having it, any images across the roof. But you can see it pretty much looks like a full vehicle wrap. So if I walk down along the side of the van, it, it looks like a full image. And then also across the back, pretty much looks like a full image. And then when you come to the other side, I've got the same going all the way across this way. So because I needed to increase my budget on the vehicle itself, I brought the budget down, the expense down in the wrap by cutting a couple of corners. And Mad Graphics was really good about that and saying, hey, you can save a couple extra hundred dollars just by cutting a few areas, the grill and then also the hood. So I am super happy with how everything turned out. <laughs> 